Hi, welcome to a Solid Edge ST10 video tutorial. I want to do that grill exercise in Solid Edge ST. Apart from the usual very strange pattern feature, it went quite well. So, let's have fun with Solid Edge. So, let's start with some sketches. I want to have a sketch on the front plane. I need a circle and the diameter should be 600. And let's draw this down and give it a dimension to the center point of the circle and this should be 100. Then I need some lines, maybe like this, okay. Make them for construction only. Let's trim. And add an angle. Yeah, let's go for angle 40 degrees and This should be maybe 80 degrees. And I will need a line, or I could use that axis, but I think I need a line. So I will draw another line here, make it 200. and make it for construction only. Close that sketch. Finish. Let's make a revolve, a surface revolve. So this should be revolved around that axis. And I will go for 70 degrees symmetric. Finish. Cancel this out. Next sketch on... I will need a rotation axis on that plane, so I go for another sketch. Right here, I need a line. Distance should be 100. And the length might be 100 as well, doesn't really matter. And make it for construction like this. Close that sketch. And there it is, yes, finish. Next sketch on the top plane. A line like this. Put the origin onto that line. And let's see if we can snap the midpoint. Let's draw this over here and go for a coincidence between this one and that one. Add a dimension and go for, let's see, 380. 
no let's go for 350 yeah that's okay close that sketch finish and a second one again a line maybe hide the revolve for the moment so I need it to be in the center then snap the origin onto the midpoint bring back the wolf just to see let's go for 180 yeah that should do close that sketch finish cancel this out now i want to make a surface extrude extrude it with this line up into that direction let's go for 300 finish cancel this out and another one with this line again 300 in that direction finish cancel this out now I want to thicken those surfaces and I want to make my quarter here. So I will thicken in that direction and in that direction by 0.5 millimeter. But I need a I will need another body. So let's go to home, go to there it is, thicken. I want to thicken this surface 0 0.5 in that direction finish cancel this out now I need a second body so go for add body name doesn't matter go for another thicken now select this surface 0 0.5 in that direction finish cancel this out now make this the active body I want to make a pattern in that direction so go for pattern go for this body select this plane so I turned it around and I want to go that's really hard to tell impossible to see so I have to check before so that went in the wider in this direction against Y and that went in this direction so it's in this quarter right here okay so that thickened yeah so if it turns around I have to go in this direction okay so select it is that correct body so that's really confusing to do that pattern here so the active body is this one yeah so select this one confirm select that plane it will turn around and I want to go in this direction so go for circular pattern part and the rotational point the center point of that circle should be here go up in that direction like this and I want to have 
six instances and no sorry 18 degrees and six instances i really don't like that pattern feature in solid edge so close this one that's okay finish okay now let's switch the active body and i want to pattern this one around that point in this direction so negative x so go for a pattern i want to pattern this here confirm select that plane here so this didn't turn around go for partial circle use that point go up in this direction and again i want to have 18 degrees and six instances close that sketch finish okay now i could make a union between those two bodies so go for a union select the first design body the second design body confirm now it's one body and i want to split that body with an offset surface and with that surface so let's go for a split split would be right here split i want to split this body with that surface confirm finish and let's take a look i want to hide that one cancel this out so this should be the active body and now i want to split two times more so go for a split and this is the body and the split tool would be that plane confirm finish and let's take a look hide this one make this the active body go for another split and select that plane is split two confirm finish cancel this out and now i want to hide this side okay make this the active body okay now i need an offset surface to my revolve surface in that direction and i want to go for two millimeter so where is it go to surfacing go to offset select the surface right click go down yes two millimeter and finish cancel this out hide the revolve and now split this body this one with that surface confirm finish cancel this out and hide this one this should be active okay great now i need two more patterns with my extrudes so go for pattern single i want to pattern this one and circle or half circle should be here so go for this one and that should be rotated that's from this point up in that direction and i need two instances and it should be 21 degrees close that sketch finish next pattern with this surface here so go for single this one it should go in that direction confirm select that surface i think it will turn around yes so let's take a look 
it should go no that's the wrong face yeah so escape I want to pattern close that sketch cancel this I want to pattern that surface so go for single select this one and the plane should be that one okay now yeah that's okay go for partial circle go here go up in this direction two instances and again 21 degrees close that sketch finish okay let's hide the extrudes for the moment i want to thicken in that direction and that direction so go for thicken select this surface and in this direction about two millimeter finish then go for this one and in this direction again two millimeter finish cancel this out okay now I want to split the body again with a new offset surface so bring back Mary Wolf go for an offset surface in that direction so up with two millimeter finish cancel this out hide the revolve and split the body with that surface so go to home boolean split this body with that surface confirm and now let's see that should be finished cancel this out and that's the upper one should be hidden great then I need another offset surface so bring back our revolve go to surfacing go to offset and now I want to do an offset in that direction with three millimeter finish cancel this out hide the revolve and now split that body once more split this body with that surface confirm finish cancel this out and hide that one nice now split again go for split this body with that plane confirm finish split the body once more with this plane confirm finish cancel this out and let's see i think those two no that's the one hide this one and that one okay now I want this to be the active body and I want to split with my two pattern copies those two so go for another split split that body with this surface confirm finish split that body with this surface confirm finish cancel this out now let's see hide this one yeah and maybe that one yeah great so somehow I locked this by accident let's see rotate okay. 
this. Now I want to bring back my revolve here. And I want to split this with two new patterned ones. So I need another circular pattern. Bring back the extrudes. Let's start with a circular pattern with this surface and go for that plane. Two instances, partial, so go there, no, yeah, of course, go up in this direction, two instances with maybe 25 millimeter, uh, millimeter degrees, close that sketch, finish, great. And then rotate this one in that direction with a circular pattern. Go for another single one. Use this one. And use that plane. That should be the right one, yes. Now it turned around, great. And go for a partial one. Select now what's rotation? So that's uh, the one, yeah. Maybe I, I, yeah, so it should go from here up in that direction. Go here, go really go over here two instances and again 25 degrees. Close that one. Let's see if I went to the right side. Yeah, I did. Now let's bring back our revolve. And I want to trim it. So maybe I can do it with two trims maybe hide the body for the moment. So this, I want this surface here. Switch to surfacing, go for trim. I will go for a chain. Let's try, I want to use this surface, that surface, this one, and that one. Confirm. And I want to remove. Yeah, that doesn't quite work. So, go for trim. Select this surface. That one should be trimmed. And I want to trim with more than one. Let's use this one and that one. Confirm and remove this part, that part, and this part. Confirm. Finish. Select this surface. Confirm. Go for another chain. Now use this surface and that surface. Right click. Remove this part and that part. And I suppose this one, yes. Confirm, finish, cancel this out. Now let's hide those extrudes and those last two patterns. And bring back those two. Okay. Now again, trim. I want to trim this surface. Right click with this surface and that surface. Right click and I want to move this part. Confirm, finish, cancel this out. Hide those patterns. 
bring back our body yeah now I want to thicken that surface so go to home thicken I want to go for two millimeter I want to thicken that one in this direction two millimeter so I will get a zero thickness great that's the usual parasolid problem that's kind of annoying but I should go maybe in this direction not in that direction so thicken that surface go for two millimeter but in this direction and that will work cancel this out now let's go for the rounds round five millimeter uh, here confirm preview finish then go for seven millimeter on this edge and that one down below this one this one confirm preview finish and then 10 millimeters here confirm preview finish cancel this out let's hide the sketches and do a mirror body part mirror copy part this one with that plane finish this body with that plane finish cancel this out and i'm done of course you could add that chamfer 0 0.5 on go here yeah select face the possibility to select an edge two setbacks no equal setbacks yes okay and you really have to go for 0 0.5 on that edge it seems it doesn't go around this one that one this one here here let's see if it works finish yeah and on the other edge as well so go again for these edges looks good confirm finish cancel this out and i'm done so hope so i hope you enjoyed this one if you did please give it a like or leave a comment if you want to see more please give it a like or leave a comment please subscribe to my youtube channel and please subscribe to my facebook cat fan page would be very nice of you i want to get more subscriptions and likes over there as well Thanks for watching. See you to the next one. Bye bye.